I'm going to give you a video tutorial right now on if you're using high definition uh, in Sony Vegas sometimes you'll get a uh, choppy video because of the size of the file and uh, Sony Vegas website has a uh, fix for it and I'm going to walk you through it and show you how simple it is to take care of the problem uh, let's get over here and take a look at the computer Got a clip here in high def. And start. If you watch the little preview window over there, um, we can play this clip and see how choppy the guy walking is. Not real easy to see it, but uh, let's see over here. A little bit. It's still playing, and you see no movement. Uh, see how choppy that is. Little pieces here, there. There it goes. Okay, well, now what we're going to do, stop that, is one of the first things it suggests to do is you go to your preview window over here and use the drop down menu and set it to preview auto. And that's, that's the first thing you want to do. Then you'll go over here to options. Select preferences. And you want to select the video tab. And in here for your dynamic RAM preview mode, uh, the maximum you can set that at is 1024 megabytes. Now it suggests that you try 512, but I found that to be a little too much, so I set it for 256. So go ahead and click Apply and OK. Now the next thing you want to do is go ahead and try and play it. Now I'm not going to waste your time here. I tried it and that didn't solve the problem. So the other thing that they suggest is that you take and render this in a temporary file in order to, to get the file size down and manageable. And so you'll click Render As render it as a video for Windows AVI. Uh, again, here we're talking real world. They suggested that you use the intermediate uh, format. I got a real weird configuration, so I took the NSTC DV, and then you click Save after you title it. I've already done this, so I'm not going to go ahead and do it here. So Anyway, we'll take this file off the timeline. And here's the rendered version of it. Zoom in on the window over here. And if we click play now, you'll see that the play that it works just fine. And it's very, very smooth. So that's an easy fix for the choppy effect of uh, video when you're using high def video in Sony Vegas 8. Alright, thank you.